Ken, Ken, do you have time for 15 questions of Vogue? Oh my God, well, what a surprise. I didn't know you were gonna be here. I'm just sitting in the park, you know, reading my book in my row, but I guess I can make time for it. But you've got 14 questions left, let's go. Can you introduce yourself to the viewers? Hello, my name is Ken. I'm from Greenville, North Carolina, and I'm an Aquarius. And how was growing up in Greenville? You know, um, I am a product of my own environment, so I do appreciate it for that, but I didn't go around people that looked like me, so that was a little tough. And now you're at school at UNC Chapel Hill. What's your major? I'm a senior double majoring in public relations and communications and advertising. And what brought you to that major? You know, I started college like most freshmen with an absolutely no idea what was going on and way, way, way too many seasons of Grey's Anatomy under my belt. So I thought I wanted to go into the medical field because I wanted to have an impact on people. But then I realized I could do that in any major and I knew I was a good communicator and was really creative. So it kind of just came natural. You mentioned Grey's Anatomy. Do you have anything you're currently binging? Oh my gosh, yes. Big Brother has been a huge binge of mine recently, but Search Party on HBO is definitely probably my favorite series. Stream it. What would you say is your biggest accomplishment? So I would say me and my friend, when right before the pandemic happened, we decided to start a magazine and we were really excited about it, you know, but our friends were saying, oh, you know, that's going to be more work than you think. And oh, that's going to be a lot more of an investment than you think. And I have something to say to you guys. You're right. But it's fine because we did it anyways and it was such a reward. It's a fashion, entertainment, and culture magazine. Um, it's called Looks Attached and we've grown our team to about 30 people, which I'm really proud of. And what's your role with Looks Attached? So I'm technically the chief creative officer, so I style and direct a lot of our photo shoots as well as oversee a lot of individual projects. Um, I handle our social media and do website upkeep, but check my resume for the full role. And what makes Looks Attached different from other magazines? Um, so we put a strong emphasis on making sure that our creatives feel like they can create freely and also that they can be involved in the creative process if they want to because we think that makes the best product. Um, and I think another thing is that we highlight small businesses and small artists, which I think is really cool. And do you have a favorite room of yours that you directed? Definitely Disco Days or It's Vegan. Those were both so much fun to shoot and you should definitely check them out. Super cool. And what's something you can't live without? Seltzer water, easy. When you're not working, what are you doing? So I'm a big lover of pop culture, music, and entertainment, so I'm always looking for the latest news. Um, but besides that, I do have a crippling TikTok addiction, but Maeve doesn't need to know about that, so cut that out. Fave album right now. Pink Panthers to hell with it. And what's something you personally live by? I think that no one can tell you whether you're great for you to know that you're great or an artist or will be successful, because if you're not believing it yourself, then how will anyone else? And last question, what do you think will make you successful in advertising? I definitely would say my awareness and my creativity. I think I have a good idea of what captivates people. And also, I like to push boundaries and create in unique and new exciting ways. Well, that's all I have. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. You know, even though this was totally spontaneous, I really appreciate you guys coming out to see me. Well, thanks, Ken. Thanks.